Dear students, I am Ravi Kumar V, Department of Mechanical Engineering, Global Academy of Technology. Today, we'll have a problem on isometric projection of rectangle slab with a square root. Let us consider a problem, a rectangle slab of base 100 mm and width 80 mm and height 30 mm as a full depth of coaxial square root side 40 mm, such that one of the sides of the square is parallel to one of the sides of the rectangle. Draw the isometric position of the combination. So now let's be the, you have to draw the isometric position of the rectangular slab with a square of 40 mm square. This will be actual isometric drawing of this combination of square hole with the rectangle slab. Okay, so now to construct by using isometric sketch sheet. Let us go, go to isometric sketch sheet. Okay, go to sketching. Now by, by using your normal scale pencil, okay, go to line, draw the line. First you start from any front left or front right corner. Okay, any front left or front right corner. Okay, one side you take 60 mm, other side you take, one side you take 80 mm, other side you take 100 mm. Okay, so right side you take um, 80 mm, left side you can take 100 mm, and thickness of this will be 30 mm. Okay, now let us go a line. I start from in the sketch sheet, okay, then one position. Okay, one side will have uh, 80 mm, so that's the right side 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. Okay, a little bit you can zoom this area. Okay, one side I've taken 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 88 boxes. Okay, each box will measures 10 mm. Okay, as with isolate. Similarly, other end, this will be 100 mm, other side of this slab will be 100 mm. Go to line command. From here, take 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. Okay, and take 100 boxes. Okay, 10 boxes. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 10 boxes. Okay, again from this side, other end will be 80. Parallel to this line. Eight boxes, okay. From here again, it will be hundred boxes. From here to here, ten boxes, okay. Here to the bit total length will be hundred mm. This side will be eighty mm. Okay, you are now constructed base side of the rectangle slab. Okay, height of the rectangle slab will be given here thirty mm. That is thickness of the slab. Okay, from go to line comma from any corner. Will measure from here 10, 20, 30. Three boxes that will be height will be 30. Similarly, her end three boxes 10, 20, 30. Draw with normal scale and pencil. Okay, similarly here 10, 20, 30. Okay, then join this rectangle slab from here. This other end also will be 30. 10, 20, 30. We join this. On top side of the rectangle. Once you got the top side of the rectangle, first step you have to erase all invisible edges or hidden edges in the rectangle slab. Now go to as usual use your uh, eraser or in base software you can use strip command in these lines. Okay, now you are drawn with the rectangular slab. Okay, offside, height 30 mm, offside one side 80, other side will be 30 mm. Inside this, you have to make a square hole, square hole exactly at the center of the slab. Okay, first you locate the center, then construct the square of 40 hole. How to construct this? Now go to line command, select normal line, locate the center, okay, center line. First you draw center line, take exactly from here, four boxes. Draw center line. From here, you locate the center of this five, 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 five box. Okay, join the locate the center of the rectangle top face. 
Once you locate the center of top is now you have to consider square of 40 here. Okay, now I'll go to line command, select as usual, this is line. From here, 20, total length side will be 40. So from center, 20 on this side, 20 another. 30 only you have to draw with the square over also with along with the ISO angle lines. That is 30 degree inclination angle line. This side also 20. From here, 10, 20. So now we have taken total length 40, this side 40. Similarly, from this side, 20. From here, 40. Again, from here, total length 40. From here, total length 40. Again, join this length. Total, this length will be total 40. Join this. Okay, once you draw this one, now you are constructed square inside the top space of the rectangular slab. Okay, exactly center. Now you have to make a square one. So when you make a square one, erase invisible edges. Here this is not visible. You can erase this inside line one. This is only you are taken for construction purpose. There is this line. Okay, now it takes this will be square hole. What will be along with when you see the object, okay, when you can full depth of this 30 mm line, that is other edge of the square hole invisible. When you see from the isometric position, this edge will be visible. Okay, and also along with this, these two lines will be visible. That you have to make dark. Okay, this will be inside, inside of the square hole. Okay, with length of 30, with a depth of 30 mm, is visible that line. Along with that, you can see this line and other end. Okay, this you have to make dark. This is how you are going to construct drawing. Okay, first square lab inside erase the line, only torque this line. This will be this edge when you view from the because this top face is visible, this edge will be visible. This also make it dark. So also you can make it dark line. Okay, this is how you are going to use isometric sketch sheet how to construct a square slab with uh, a square a square wall with a rectangular slab. First, what you have to do is simple thing. First, you take any one corner, short from any one corner. From here 80, from this side 100, first construct bottom square slab, then take 30, 30, 30 all four corners, then draw top side corner, top side rectangle slab. Once you construct this, locate this center, with the center take 20 on this side, 20 on this side, 20 on this side, 20 on this side. Okay, you'll get in corner of these four corners. From there you take 40, 20 this side, 20 this side, total 40 this side, 40, 40. Construct square slab, erase inside lines, then draw dark on this line. This will be visible edge. When you see from isometry, this will be visible edge. This is also visible inside the line will be visible. That you make it dark. Okay, this will be complete. Even if you will take isometric sheet, this kind of problem you can complete within five minutes. You'll get 25 marks for this. Okay. So uh, similarly, how to construct by using even solid edge software. Same drawing you can use by using solid edge software. Okay, go to uh, solid edge. Okay, simple, similar way with the plane sheet you using drawing. Okay, what is the side will be given? You start from one point, side will be given one side 80, enter angle 30. Okay, other side this edge 100. Okay. 150 angle, it can be 150. Similarly, this will be 100, enter angle 150, enter. Then join this. Now you have constructed bottom of the rectangle. Now you have to construct top of the rectangle. Height will be given 30 mm. Take height 30. Okay. So one method you can copy this and paste it here. Otherwise, you can draw normal method. Can do it. So take 30 mm height in the upper corner. Take 30, enter, and the here 30, enter, join this. Join this. So now you can select a tank slab. And similarly, use the team command as invisible edges. So now only on retain this. Then go to normal line or projection line in software. Okay, select normal line. Okay, the center will be midpoint of the center from year to year, midpoint of this. Okay, once you draw this, okay, construct a square 
inside center of the visible line from here 20 from here 20 from here 20 from here 20 okay 20 From here, twenty. Forty. From here, forty. Forty. Now we constructed a right square slab. Okay. Stream inside edges. Inside edges, then go to line command. Okay, from here, okay, with the full depth, you can square all the rectangle slab full depth. You can see only 30 mm full depth visible. Okay, from here again, from this end, you have to draw parallel to this line, parallel to this line, make a draw this line, and this also parallel to this. Okay, so we are going to construct by using solid edge software. Okay. Thank you.